Hey boot campers, I am here in Savannah, Georgia. I've waited for it to cool down a little bit and I'm gonna be bringing to you a great fusion workout where we're gonna combine some fast paced cardio with some Pilates and yoga. We're gonna start off pretty fast so make sure you do a three to five minute warm up and then we are ready to get started. So I've got 10 moves for you and we're gonna do each move for 30 seconds. Okay, so the first move that we're gonna do is a jump rope. I want you to grab your imaginary jump rope and we're just gonna alternate. And you can see I have bare feet. Um, I did bring running shoes, but I decided to just go barefooted. It's a nice plush grass here. So I'm gonna enjoy a little shoeless action. If you have uh, sensitive feet and you need to keep your sneakers on, by all means, do that. Four, three, two, and let's shuffle. Four, three, two, four, three, two, four, three, two. So lots of fast feet. And these are all things that could really add some steps if you're limited on time. How you doing? Fast feet. Three, two, one, and give me some football feet. So quick feet right here. Go ahead and use those arms as well. Now turn to the side. Four, three, two, back to the center. And to the side. And five seconds to the center. Four, three, two, back to jump rope. Side to side this time. And hop on one foot. Other side. Switch. Switch. 10 seconds. And back to side to side. Oh, look who's here. How's it going? <laughs> All right, squat jacks. Where were y'all? Across the river. They went on a beer fest. That was fun, yeah? All right, so keep those knees bent. Open the chest. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, squat jab. Right here. Punch across your body. and ski. Four, three, shuffle. Three more. Two more. Want to feel that heart rate up. Some seafood, so that when we come to 
Savannah. I love to get oysters. And usually fresh shrimp and lots of salads. You could definitely travel and eat healthy. Eight, seven, four, three, two, broad jump, back pedal, lunge, side to side. Broad jump. for you and you're going to really feel this in those areas, chest, shoulders, and abs. If you need to modify, you're just going to bring these down to your knees. So the very first thing that we're going to do is called dancing dog. We're going to start in a down dog and then we're going to scoop, raise your thighs to the mat and lift your chin towards the sky. And down dog and lift. Press your heels into the ground and lift. Inhale, really feel that stretch through the arms. That feels so good. I'm getting a nice hamstring stretch while I'm in the down dog. I'm pressing those heels in and I'm extending my arms, pulling the belly tight. Give me five seconds. And Last one. All right, we're gonna end, start in this plank. I want you to bring your left foot up to your left hand, and then you're gonna rotate, twist back, and then right foot to the outside, rotate, and step back. Left foot, left hand, and twist. Now I need you to look at your front knee. Make sure when you step up, it comes up far enough so you have a nice 90 degree angle. Twist. Look at your shoulder. Straight line from one side of the hand to the other. Two more. And last one. Good. Now come to plank. If you need a modification here, come down to your knees. Shoulder tap. Right here. Try to keep your belly pulled up, your back flat, your butt down. Arms are going to be feeling amazing. Think of just how great they look when you wear a tank top. 10 seconds. Four, three, two, one. All right, go from two hands. To one hand. If you need to modify, bring one knee down. Keep your belly button facing the ground. And switch. So, shoulders are pointed straight down. Belly is pointed straight down. And switch. Eight seconds. Four, three, two, switch. Great job. Okay, still so holding plank, alternating leg lifts. If you need to modify, you're here. All right? And lift. Twelve 
Okay, last one. You're either gonna go up, up, back, back, or up, up, back, back. Go. Choose your heart. Hop, hop, flatten. You got this. Don't even think about quitting. You're close. Five. Four, strong arms, strong minds. Two, and last one. So good, you guys. All right, the last section, we're gonna be lying down on our back, and we're gonna be doing some Pilates moves. So I want you to lie all the way back, and I want you to bring your arms over your head. Bring your knees into your chest, and then extend the arms and extend the legs. Now, if it's too hard to do both legs, just do one knee at a time. So, in, in, all right? Six, five, four, three, two, one. Great job. Bring your legs straight up. You're going to reach for your toes. You're going to use a reverse crunch. Lift your glutes. And then a double leg lift. All right? So reach, reverse crunch, double leg lift. Reach, reverse crunch, double leg lift. Exhale. Four more. Reach. number one, which is going to be easier. Option number two, we're going to extend the legs and then reverse it. So choose your heart. We have seven more. Keeping your legs straight, your toes pointed, your abs and your obliques engaged. If your legs are straight, you're really going to feel this in the quads as well. We have four more. You got this. How strong are you? How committed are you? I know you got it. Two. And last one. So good. All right, coming to your side. I need you to pike a little bit. So I've got my hand right next to my, my leg. This top arm is going to come up. I'm gonna to come to my forearm and I'm gonna to reach to this top leg. I'm not sure, this is the low option. So let's do four like this. Four, three, two. You're feeling this in the obliques. You're advanced. Both legs are hovering. Both legs come up. So hover, come up. 12, 11, 10, 8, 7, 6. How you doing? Feeling that waist shrink right now, right? 3, 2, and switch sides because you want it to be even. All right, let's do four. Option number one. And then if you need to keep it here, you can. And then both legs. 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 
seven, six, five, four, three. Point those toes, come on. Two, and one. Finish on your back. We're gonna do a combination of a bicycle and scissor. So one leg is gonna be tall, and one leg is extended. I've got this arm out to the side, bringing my elbow up. We'll do 12, 11, low option. Bend that knee. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. It's so much cooler now. I think it's like seven o'clock. It was so humid earlier. That was melting. I'm excited to come visit in like November. Four, three, two, and one. Great job. Okay, we're gonna finish with something called six inches. Place your hands underneath your glutes. You're gonna lift your shoulders and you're gonna fold your legs. So you're gonna spread up together. Spread them. Together. Hold. Flutter. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. Rest. Alright, let's repeat that. So if you need to protect your neck, just keep your head on the ground. But if you can lift your shoulders, that's going to help press your back down. So extend your legs. You could also lift your legs if you have a sensitive back. Spread them. Together. Spread them. Hold it out. Scissors. Switch. Four, three, two. Together. Flutter. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. So awesome, you guys. All right, there you go. Fusion for the whole body. We worked everything. Here's to loving the body you live in, blasting fat, and getting a tone lean body at the